Gasdermin D hypermethylation inhibits pyroptosis and LPS induced IL-1 beta release from NK92 cells. The natural killer cells or the NK cells have several proteolytic enzymes. When activated, these enzymes are released and they can kill the cancer cells. There are more than 900 approved NCI protocol to use NK cells to treat cancer patients. But there are several challenges, like these cells also releases inflammatory cytokines and such inflammation can be dangerous in cancer patients. The immune cells such as monocytes and macrophages are known to release interleukin 1 beta via gas dermin mediated pyroptosis. When these cells senses a pathogen or a danger uh, such as LPS which induces conversion of pro-caspase 1 into caspase 1 hence conversion of gas dermin D into cleaved gas dermin D molecule in turns making gas dermin pore or the process is called as pyroptosis which helps in the release of interleukin 1 beta this interleukin 1 beta release was mediated by gas dermin D However, similar process is not known in NK92 cells. Two molecules, dimethyl fumarate and monomethyl fumarates, are known to inhibit pyroptosis in monocytic cells via modulation of the gas dermin D gene. Our search showed that uh, gas dermin D gene contains several CPG islands in its promoter region, hence rendering it to be hypermethylated or epigenetically mediated silencing of this gene is possible. In this study, we showed that LPS induces production and caspase 1 mediated conversion of pro IL-1 beta into IL-1 beta. Also we showed that the release of IL-1 beta involved gas dermin D mediated pyroptotic pore formation. The DMF and MMF were shown to inhibit the production as well as release of IL-1 beta from these cells. Further, we also showed that DMF and MMF induced DNMT mediated hypermethylation silencing of gas dermin D gene, thus inhibiting the release of IL-1 beta from NK92 cells. Thank you very much.